Hey y'all, so today I'm going to show you all how to turn your sparse eyebrows into on fleek eyebrows. As you can tell, my eyebrows are very sparse, so I like to just fill them in. I'm going to start off by using this pink eyebrow razor that I got from Target. And I'm just going to use this on the top of my eyebrows just because it's easier to use it up there as opposed to at the bottom. And I'm just going to clean that up a little bit. Next I'm going to take this spoolie that I got from Target as well and it's just a little dollar spoolie that I got from e.l.f. Cosmetics at Target and I'm going to brush my eyebrow hairs up and over so that I can get a little bit of a shape going on there. Now I'm going to take these tweezers and I'm going to use those to help me get a little bit more of a shape at the bottom and also clean up all those little stray hairs. Okay, so I'm going to use this NYX Micro Brow Pencil, and it's double-ended. It has the pencil on one end and the spoolie on the other. And I'm going to use the pencil side to fill in starting at the front of my brow. And I'm going to use light strokes, and I'm going to work my way back starting at the bottom and then making my way to the top. Now, how I usually do this is... I'm going to kind of fake a shape so I'm using this little pencil to kind of outline how I want my eyebrow to look but I'm still going to try and keep the shape of my natural eyebrow if that makes sense so you can see at the end I'm kind of making a little point so I can have a sharp edge and we can always go back and fix it later but this is just going to be the outline of how the eyebrow will look. Here I'm going to use the spoolie end of the micro brow pencil and I'm going to brush my hairs up and over once again so that it can kind of fit into the outline that I made. Now we have a decent shape here. Now I'm just going to take that same pencil and I'm going to fill in the eyebrow and I'm going to make sure I focus it on the areas where there's really no hair and here at the front. I'm going to brush them forward so that it won't be a harsh line in the front and it can kind of be a gradient and be a little lighter and then get a little darker as it goes backwards. And once again, I'm going to brush my hairs up and over so that they can kind of be in a uniform direction. And we're going to use the tip of the spoolie to kind of help make that edge of the eyebrow a little bit more sharp. Now I'm going to take this HD concealer that I got from my local beauty supply store for a couple of dollars and I'm going to take this e.l.f. brush that I got from Target for a dollar and I'm going to put a little bit of the concealer on the end of my eyebrow and then work my way up because I don't want there to be a big glob right in the front of my eyebrow of concealer. I feel like just starting in the back and then working your way forward makes it look a little bit more natural that way.
Here I'm going back in with the pencil and I'm just filling in any spots that may have gotten swiped away by the spoolie. The next step would be to go ahead and use a clear brow gel. This one is also from the cosmetic brand e.l.f. And I'm going to just use a light hand and brush those hairs that are kind of falling below the line up and over again. And again, I like to use a light hand because you really don't need that much product. Here you can see how my left eyebrow looks much more sparse than my right one. I'm just showing you a comparison. And that one looks a lot better there on the right hand side. A trick that I like to use is to use my finger and pat where I put the concealer at so that it can look a little bit more natural that way and then you can't really tell where I actually put the concealer. Here I decided to just use a Jordana pencil that I got from Walgreens and use it to darken up my eyebrow a little bit. On camera, the pencil that I used at first looked a little bit light. In person it looked okay, but on camera it was looking a little light, so I just did this for the purpose of the video. Here I'm just going to use the concealer just to clean it up again at the bottom. I use a little at the top end of the eyebrow just so I can have a sharp tail. But I usually don't use concealer at the whole top of my eyebrow. But that's just me. It's just my preference. Alright ladies and gents, and that is how you keep your natural shape yet fill in your eyebrows. That is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.